you have to have a heart for service. Pastor Abraham Bellinger and his wife, Taiwana, <laughs> founded First Fruits Community Church three years ago. Yes, we're getting ready to expand. We're going to acquire another unit, knock out some walls, expand our sanctuary, uh, along with our food bank, so we can uh, continue to serve our community yet even better. Then, a vision to help feed those in need. Our food bank we launched in, uh, I think it was May or June of 2015. Uh, and so since then, it's been picking up pace. We've been serving a lot of families here in Somerville. Thanks to monetary online donations and non-perishable food donations from community drives and businesses, the Somerville Food Bank here at First Fruits Community Church has helped nearly 1,000 families, 500 this year alone. So a lot of people are living from paycheck to paycheck, and um, we've heard so many stories of you know, people having to choose, okay, do, do I feed my, my kids? Do I uh, keep the mortgage? What, you know, how do, do I keep the lights on or how do I get food? And a lot of times they have to, to keep the roof over their head while they send their kids to bed at night hungry. And, and it's just unfortunate. The sting of hunger is a feeling familiar to Pastor Bellinger. I was in a place before in my life where uh, I was homeless for a little while. And there was times where I didn't really have, you know, a lot of food and so, you know, I just kind of see the need and I've always had a heart for people. It's up to people like us, uh, no matter how small or great of an influence we have, to see what we can do. In addition to the non-perishable food, they also distribute fresh meat and dairy products, making a difference one family at a time. We actually uh, had a family that came uh, for a few months and got food from us and then things started going uphill for them and, and they got to doing really better and now they contribute to the food bank so we're definitely making a difference. As a show of appreciation the food bank has also provided groceries to police officers, firefighters and first responders. The goal is to increase outreach efforts through a growing food bank. Well, I, I'm proud of him. I mean he does what he does what it comes from the heart. There are people that are in our church now because of the food bank, they came in looking for food, looking for help. They came in and they and they they found they got food, they got the natural help they needed, but then they also got what they needed spiritually too. So yeah, I know he's making a difference in everyone's life that he touches. Octavia Mitchell, count on two.